guys let's do a reaction video to the indie highlights that popped up today um yeah hopefully you can hear me okay as well as what's going on on the screen you can't see me but that's cool you don't need to see <laughs> pretty so pretty Indie Highlights, yeah! Hello everybody and welcome to our <coughs> Indie Highlights presentation. A whistle-stop tour that's filled to the brim with top indie games coming to Nintendo Switch. We've been working with some of the most talented independent developers on the planet. I was told this was a rumor that they were coming out with a direct today, so yeah, it's, I'm excited that them, they actually Nintendo did. Nintendo Switch is already home to some tip-top independent games. Tip -top. And here's a bunch more. I love her accent. You're an inquisitive cabbie, helping the Parisian police investigate a vivid cast of potential serial killers while making enough money to pay your bills okay. in Night Cool. That sounds like a sitcom. You know, I kind of I kind of like games like this. I think they're cool. So, yeah, I might have to check this out. Night call. Experience a new kind of narrative noir game when the super stylish Night Call releases in early 2019. Being a human is pretty cool. But have you ever tried Monster being Boy? A pig, a I've snake, already pre-ordered it. And a dragon all in one day at least I think I have wait a minute no that's another game that's another game I have pre-ordered games guys I don't forgot what I pre-ordered Actually, no. I did pre-order that pre-order that game, guys. I pre-ordered that game March 8th. So yeah, I have pre-ordered this game. <clears throat> Isn't it cute? It's so colorful. Awesome sauce. Monster Boy in the Cursed Kingdom shape shifts onto Nintendo Switch on November 6th. Shifts. What would you do if you could control time? Save people in need? Sleep in longer? How about solve a load of brain teasing conundrums? Give me the conundrums. Yo, the music, guys, is on point. Oh, wow. This is gorgeous. <clears throat> the gardens between. Okay. So far, so the good. Everything is looking nice. The Gardens Between makes the journey to Nintendo Switch on September 20th. You can pre-order from Nintendo eShop right now. Okay. okay. It's time to hit the mean, procedurally generated streets. streets this brilliantly good. balmy brawler is coming to Nintendo Switch with four-player co-op and exclusive enhancements. 
Det skal lige se, hvad har vi sådan? This reminds me of that other game that came out on the Switch. What was it? Was it something Strider or something like that? Is that what it was? Something Striker? Something Striker? Strider? I don't remember. You know that game where you can run, you know, run real fast, you shoot people, and yeah, I don't remember. I have to put it down below or put a little thing up. Came out alone. Like back. That's almost when the switch came out. It's cute though. There is a game that I want to see come to the switch, guys. And I don't know. I doubt if it ever will, but it's called um Party Hard. I would love to see because that kind of almost some a little bit reminds me of this in a little bit but um I want to see something like that come to the switch that would be so fun Streets party hard is a crazy game if y'all haven't seen it look it up <clears throat> beards and boats and bows and arrows Defend your island kingdom from hordes of Viking Bad invaders more. in this charming but brutal real-time tactics roguelite. Okay. Oh, I like those. I love roguelite game, real-time tactic games. I love those. Mm. Defend your home. Okay. I like this. It's almost kind of like chess. That is so cool. You know, the Switch has got some awesome games on it already, and then we have these coming out Bad soon. Is marauding its way Man. Onto the Nintendo e -shop right now, now, Nintendo, y'all need to get y'all online in order before you start charging and now, people. Some updates from our but friends at 11 Bit story. Studios. Moonlighter. Okay. of mine. <clears throat> okay. Mm. Don't sleep on the indies.
Children of Morta. This war of mine. <coughs> oh, like mad, you? And Moonlighter are all making their way to Nintendo Switch. Autumn. Pew, pew, pew! Embark on a challenging journey through an ever-changing cosmos in Everspace. A fast-paced roguelike space shooter. Okay. Internet connection required during online play. <coughs> Ew. You know, if Nintendo had went forward with the VR thing or whatever it is they were talking about doing, this right here looks like it will make a great VR game. Look at that. You've got the cockpit right there in your face. That would, yeah. This would have made a, this look like this would be a really cool VR game. I'm not much of a space shooter person, but this looks noise. interesting. I have been ordered to execute search and destroy warrants in the demilitarized zone. You're a bounty hunter? Why didn't you attack me on site then? We of the Coalition have bigger plans. The place is infested with gray goose swarms. Someone has to destroy them. Everspace Stellar Edition, featuring the base game and the Encounters expansion, blasts off this December. So get ready to shoot, loot, and craft your way to victory. Who are you? Baba? Baba is me. <laughs> Baba. Baba is you. <laughs> In this tricky puzzler, you don't just make the rules, you Baba. are the rules. <laughs> That's funny. Baba is you. Okay, this is, this is different. Flag is win. I don't know about this one, y'all. It's cute, but... I don't know. Don't know what to expect from this. Wall is stop. I don't know about this one. That's a little too vague for me. Call the shots in over 100 brain teasing levels when Baba is You comes to Nintendo Switch this autumn. Craft a unique deck of cards, encounter bizarre creatures, and discover relics of immense power in Slay the Spire from Mega Crit Games. Ooh, humble bundle. Slay the Spire. Oh my goodness, let me tell you something y'all, I have got to get this. This looks really cool. I'm going to see if there's any more uh, videos on this one. I am loving this. I'm loving it. I like this. This is really cool.
this seems like one of them games that's going to end up costing you a lot of money though because I'm sure they're going to have those little card packs and stuff in the store which you have to buy separate. <clears throat> but I, I like I like this concept. I really do. Play your cards right. Slay the spire cards. climbs the tower in early 2019. All right. I'm going to look that the up. The fast-paced sports action game of the 90s. Windjammers will return on Nintendo Switch. Okay, there's a lot of um, videos on Slay the Spire, y'all, so I'm going to be checking that out for sure. Definitely. Windjammers. Hold up, didn't they have a game similar to this, guys? That came out on PlayStation and stuff? That was called Disc Jammers or something like that, wasn't it? Disc Jam, Disc Jammers. And it was more of a 3D aspect to it, if I'm not mistaken. So... Was that modeled after this? Wait, what's this? Windjammers 2. They remind you when them old school. Windjammers 2 is sure to serve up fun when it launches in 2019. You can warm up with the original Windjammers from October 23rd oh, this year. Okay. Gonna have to get your hey, dig practice this. on. Oh, Terraria! Terraria! Terraria's coming to the Switch! Stop playing. I've got it. On everything, <laughs> I've got it on my Vita. Rise and shine, inmates. Terraria is a great game to be able to play on the go. Oh my God, Prison Architect! I love the Architect games. I love them. After a award, when look at this. Prison Architect puts you in charge of your very I gotta get it. Look after your inmates by building a secure lockup, keeping them safe and healthy. Prison Architect, y'all, is coming to the Switch. I hope they have a physical copy. But be careful. People have needs. <coughs> Treat them poorly and you'll find yourself with a riot on your hands. Uh -oh. The game includes a fully fledged story mode that explores the grim and gruesome reality of legal grey areas in the prison system and an in depth sandbox mode. This takes a lot of skill, y'all. For sure. So players across the globe can test drive your creations. Oh, I love that! Prison Architect for Nintendo Switch is a premium edition, which includes two expansions, All Day and a Night and Sight Ward, letting Stop you up the challenge with new wardens and maps, as well as a new security class, the Criminally Insane. Okay. As something else to look forward to, a new add-on pack based on Prison Architect's wildly popular escape mode will be available on Nintendo Switch later this summer. Oh my god. In escape mode, you take this on the role amazing. of an inmate, carry out missions, earn cash, recruit new crew members, and do whatever it takes to dig, sneak, swim, or fight your way to freedom. Oh, this is so cool. Will you build a calm utopia of rehab and care, or come down on your inmates with an iron fist? After all, it's your prison, your rules. Win. Win. Knuckle down and lock him up. Prison Architect Nintendo Switch Edition is available to download right now. What? Oh, Escape how much? Mode will be available to purchase as downloadable content later this I summer. I gotta see how much it is. Get ready for massively Morphe player action in Morphe's Law. Oh, Morphe's Law! Online shooter where your size affects your abilities. Now that the humans are gone, we can get there. It is Morphe's Law is ready to download now too, y'all. Prison Morphe's. Architect is thirty the bucks. Give us one purpose, 
Are they not putting it out here, please? We should roll. I need to see if it is y'all uploading any videos on Morphe's Law because that look funny as crap. How much is that? That game is 20 bucks. Bad North is out too, y'all, too. I'm gonna have to check out Nemorphe's Law. It looks funny. Thanks for that, big guy. Morphe's Law shoots onto Nintendo eShop tonight. Yeah, that's out By already. Way, all the titles on screen right now will be playable on the show floor at Gamescom 2018. If you're there, we hope you'll swing by and give them a whirl. And if you're not there, look forward to seeing them on Nintendo eShop in the future. We hope you enjoyed this Indie Highlights presentation. As always, we'll continue to deliver new information on all sorts of independent titles coming to Nintendo Switch in the future. In fact, stay tuned for even more info coming very soon. Thanks for watching! That was cool! Alright, so overall guys, I have to say that this was really cool. Again, there are games that are currently already out that was announced here. And that is Morphe's Law, Bad North, Prison Architect. Prison Architect is $29.99, Bad North is $14.99, Morphe's Law is $19.99. And yeah, I'm going to have to get that um, Prison Architect for sure. I normally don't like to pay regular price for games on the eShop and I wish that they had come out with a physical copy of the game but it is what it is I'm still get it so um yeah I have got to get that prison architect I love those types of games y'all I love those types of games they're freaking amazing they're so fun um and to be able to play that on the go is amazing because the only other place I had been able to play it was on the console and um so yeah i'm glad that they actually have prison architect on the switch so yeah there was a ton of great games that they've announced here um for this indie highlights and i'm excited so leave your comments down below let me know how you feel about this showcase thank you all for watching this with me if you're not currently subscribed to the channel be sure to hit that subscribe button for more videos coming here in the near future, this is Lynn, a.k.a. iPod One Reviewer. Till next time, guys, take care, be safe, love one another, and we'll see you all later. Peace.